Finally got the rubble cleared. Starting to feel it was bad. <laughs> the Venatori were making sacrifices. I got everything you need for kicking the Venatori right out of this world. Safe travel. I need an update on that last expedition. We might be able to restore that bridge. It would make a good shortcut through this area. talking about no return. it's the trapped spirit from the necropolis is it right the mold you do you think you can succeed in facing me where the venatory failed <laughs> Two demons down. Oh. Or two versions of the same demon. 
I've seen spirits in Arlathan split themselves like this, but they never went as far as this demon's avatars. They'll come back if we don't find the rest. So, Blackthorn Manor. Ugh. Let's hope that necromancer working with the Venatori is around. There's a malaise amongst the spirits here. Some form of confinement. This must be the place. Right. So why'd we bring that? Oh, it's essential we have the Hand of Glory. Does that thing actually work? Yes, but we're not using it for its intended purpose. The magic laid upon a hand of glory is complex. Whoever killed its donor left their mark. So, it'll lead us to whoever cut it off? Precisely. Most likely the necromancer who's been helping the Venatori. It would have taken extraordinary skill to layer the involutions on this artifact. <sighs> What a waste of talent. Hemrick? Focus. I am. I only think it's worth considering the complexity of the... Forbidden necromancy can twist spirits. We must find this death mage and stop whatever they've done to them. There's a rogue necromancer here. They forgot to lock the door. The Hand of Glory's magic points inward to the northeast. Let's go look. I don't like this. These sigils. They can't be. Necromantic evocation with an inversion in the higher seals. Our rogue necromancer has hidden something terrible behind this door. Can you open it? The door seals are drawing on magic elsewhere in the manor, fueled by suffering. Let's put an end to that and get this door open. The Hand of Glory points to the northeast and southwest. Demons!
Now what? I must free the spirit bound here. Ah! Emmerich? Someone's been harvesting their terror. Their souls! How dare they? What are they thi- Come, I can sense another spirit trapped here in the mansion. Look at the door. Freeing one spirit has already weakened its seals. Halfway there. Have you noticed anything strange about the Fade itself here? It's like places in Arlathan where the old elves did a lot of magic. The spirits press closer than they should. Another victim. We've got demons again. Death's final call. Good work. One Emmerich? I must. Still in one piece. Ah! What's wrong? Someone's been stealing the life, the essence of people who knew they were facing death. The effects persist. But the door we saw earlier should be unsealed. Hope that necromancer we're after is behind it. All the seals have been extinguished. Excellent. Let's open that door. Someone's torn a path into the Fade. It's imperative we find and stop this necromancer from keeping the Fade open. Mierda. The door's locked. It's the work of that rogue necromancer. They're already blocking our path. We must find a wisp to open it. Emmerich, this one's all yours. Done in a moment.
onwards. Hand of glory still points the way. Demon, we must be getting close. Our rogue necromancer knows exactly where we are. Why have they gone to such lengths to drain power from spirits? Oh. Down there, four victims. I don't see that rogue necromancer yet. I suspect they're nearby. Let's inspect their handiwork. Professor? But what else would one expect from Navarra's most eminent meddler? Johanna Hesenkos! You've met? Oh, the Professor and I have known each other for ages. But only one of us realized the Watchers are no place for a mage with ambition. <laughs> Big talk. Rook's correct. There'll be no more victims. <laughs> Trying to impress your new friend, are we? No. The stolen life in that lantern could permanently tear open the Fade here. Correct. Only the foolhardy would shed blood near it in this state. So, let the Watchers mourn your pathetic death in the Fade, Emric Volcaren. Those that are left after my return. No. What is she planning? Emric, we okay to fight? Yes, you have to take the lantern away from me. Cost due to that spirit. I'll try freeing it, but I fear the worst. Nothing. The spirit, its essence, is gone. Johanna's trapped it in her lantern. Then let's find her. There's no way out. What do we do now? The Fade always provides a way forward. We only need to search for it. Then let's get looking. A candle. This wasn't here before. Oh, let me think. We're in a receptive eddy of the Fade, and since Johanna's spirit summoning has already focused its mana, do you recall the ritual we performed in the Grand Necropolis? Concentrate on that memory. You mean when we were lighting candles? Find some more, and we can use them to leave this place. Hey. 
Here's that last candle. Excellent. Place them on the pedestals, if you would. We drift upon the echo. Let them form a new configuration. And with that... Let's get back to the real world. We must find Johanna once we're out of here. This rift in the Fade will lie open until we deal with her. You insufferable nuisances! How did you get out so quickly? Where's Hezenkaz's voice coming from? The Hand of Glory resonates. It's pointing to the main hall. Let's go. I can feel Johanna summoning hostile spirits. That portal into the Fade won't close until we defeat them. But we still can't attack Hezenkaz herself while she's holding that lantern? The entire countryside would be torn apart in a maelstrom. So you crawled your way out of the Fade. It's not difficult for those who treat spirits better than tools to an end, Johanna. Sentimental drivel. You may have stopped my work here, but Navarra City will know its new ruler. We doing this or not? A death wish. You and Valkaren must be quite the pair. Though the Professor clearly avoided mentioning his old colleague in exile. We made every attempt to bring you to reason. I gave you every chance to join me instead of whining endlessly about your mortality. But I must thank you for returning something dear to me. Lovely to have my hand back. I'd exchanged it with the Venatori for some favors after entering this... condition. Johanna, what have you done? What you never had the courage to. For the record, I do not have a death wish. Johanna's escaped again. Do you tell me why she has no eyes? Afterwards, we'll... It's over. Emmerich, still sense anything wrong? We were successful. Johanna's magic no longer changed the spirits, and the fade is still. Great, okay. But let's talk back at the lighthouse. At least we freed those spirits from their suffering. Shall we depart? Let's get back to the lighthouse. Gladly. Oh, the Song of the Chambers won't have anything on what Johanna's... Perhaps the Waking Scrolls. No. Manfred, have you seen the Felmarch manuscript? Remember how I said we should talk? Uh, indeed. Johanna Hesenkos was a watcher. She was banished for embracing the darker paths of our art. Forbidden magic, blood sacrifice, nothing is beyond her if it leads to power, recognition, or both. It sounded like you knew her before all that. We were friends, once.
Someone like that had friends? Ah, <sighs> things used to be different. She truly was brilliant, and we got on so well as students. We partnered on papers, rituals, research. Yet even then, Johanna considered the Watcher's oaths quaint. This isn't the first time we've crossed paths since she was exiled, but now I fear she's turned herself partly undead. She made herself half undead on purpose? There are advantages to undeath you may not be familiar with. I'm good. You saw Johanna's Lantern of Unwilling Souls. A necromancer could create monstrous undead with that much stolen life. Hesengaz was yelling a lot about conquering Navara City. We must stop her, Rook. <laughs> Thank you, Manfred. Quite right. The Order's knowledge will see us through. Hesenkos had been stopped. For now. But she had big plans for Navara. City conquering, new ruler plans. <laughs> and while she had some regrets about long lost friendships, she knew her greatest invention was going to bring down the house. So, Tosh. Well, he did worse than just try to kill me. Really? The guy stiffed me on the job. Those were good potions I used. Expensive, too. Right. That makes sense. Something I should know about? Not much. Just sitting. You know. Why don't you join Ballara, Rook? I was just leaving. Bell, swing by when you get a chance. I found another set of papers for you. Thanks, Nev. That's nice. Sorry, Rook. Not great company right now. We can sit here in broody, stoic silence together. Just be careful Lucanus doesn't see you. He might challenge you to a brood off. I don't know. I'm getting good at it. Yeah, but he's brooding for two now. <laughs> Fair enough. I need everyone on this team to have a clear head. So tell me what's going on. Nothing, Rook. Don't worry about it. I asked, didn't I? It's Syrian. You saw who he is. What he's become. Yeah. He's a monster, Rook. But despite that, he's still your brother. I would have done anything to get him back. Even join someone like that, like Anaris. But you didn't. You turned them down. I did, but Rook... It was hard. I wanted my brother back. 
I mean, before all of this, Sirian and I were the same. Inquisitive, driven, pushing ourselves. The search for the Nadis Drathalin, the Archive, that was both of us, working together. I want to say I'll keep saying no, keep turning him down, but he's my brother. What keeps me from doing what he did? You're not Syrian, Ballara. You're you. And what if that's not good enough? Then keep your evil to off hours. Replace Lucanus' coffee beans with hot peppers. Buy Nev a bag of wisp food. Hide Tasha's snacks. <laughs> You're not very good at being evil. <laughs> I'll work on it. I'm kind of making this up as I go. Our team motto, pretty much. Let's paint that on the side of the lighthouse. I'm sure Solas would love that. You good? I'm good. Thanks, Rook. I'll see you later. Hey. Well, I'm late. Try grabbing something from Hal's on the way, but the fish fry is not running. So much for supper. What have you been doing? Chasing leads. On alias Venatori, Darktown's missing people, and anything that might come close. Find anything? Plenty. Something I can use is another story. So here we are. I'm out of leads, and you're out that supper I promised. Were you waiting for a simple job? A girl can dream. I could use a walk. And some rocks. You up for it? Rocks? Yeah. So, rocks. Look for good ones. You were serious about this. You'll see why. Why are we doing this? You know what they say, leave no stone unturned. Really? No.
All right, name one job of yours that didn't get complicated. A circle mage hired me to find a book. He said it was stolen and contained information that couldn't get out. What happened? It was a diary. It had fallen behind a dresser. Walked away from that job in an hour. Wow. All right, time to put these rocks to use. Come on. How are we doing? With the rocks or in general? Let's stick with the rocks. In that case, so far so good. A win for us. I guess it is. Calliope, you're still going. Over here. I'll take you to my usual spot. Fancy. Isn't it? Is this what you do when you're out of leads? I'd look over my notes, but I've got them by heart. I just need to clear my head. Nev Gallus, without her mind racing. I'd hardly know you. Aren't you clever? So, what are you thinking? You can't count on a lot here. When I started, I wasn't going to save Minrathus, never mind Thedas. But if I could take a job and follow through, well, maybe people could count on me. But at the end of the day, what have I done? What sticks? Venatory everywhere, Aelia waltzing back into town. I'm fighting, Rook. Sometimes it feels as though the city itself stabs me in the back. Not on my watch. I'm here for you. I'm getting that impression. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. What? Getting mixed up with me. Nev. Or that... Or that I want you to. It's not crazy. There's a lot to lose. Isn't there always? <laughs> Have I told you your trouble? Got something. Maybe. Come on. Well, ready to chase a long shot. We need to get to the spillway. You've got something on Alia? We were watched. By the cat. Sure. I mean at the relic deal. When Aelia controlled Damas, she mentioned Bataris and the stolen relic. Why bring that up? Why would she care? Do you think she was involved? Or one of her puppets. She's been careful, but there may be something to pick up at the site. A witness. Anything. So we're returning to the scene of the crime, where we fought Bataris? It's just a hunch, but it's the best I've got. I'm with you. Let's see what's there. What's the plan? Bataris had a red Lyrian relic. Those don't play nice with the Veil. The Viper left me in peace of... Remnants fade with time, but if we got here soon enough... Remnants. We've got them. Fainter than the ones we found before. But I'll see what I can draw out. Let's take a look. I've got this. 
Echoes of greed, pride, our venatori, the Taurus. Sure thing. The Thread Smuggler. But this feels scrambled. Two people's thoughts in one source. She wasn't a traitor. She was a puppet. Alia moving goods to her followers. Look there. There's more. By the waterfall. Look, I realize you just kissed a girl, and now I've got you chasing leads. I realize I kissed Nev Gallus, and this is part of your charm. And I thought you were sweet before. This one's afraid. A witness? Someone else showed up too, after we left. If I can pull out more of an echo, a memory. So Nev Gallus is back. Tell me what you saw. Nothing, I swear. Alia. A bystander? They must have seen the fight. Then Alia showed up. Tell me, would you see this city rise? Be a thrall in service to its glorious rebirth? Thrall? No, I... No! Silence! Your will... Belongs to the Venatori. Damn it! The risen god will unlock my true power. He's given me Vena Vitalis. We start here. What's Vena Vitalis? A rumor, an old Tevinto ritual to increase blood magic. Fake accounts appear on the black market. The real records were burned by magisters. It scared them. But if Alia follows Elganon, if he could give her the trick. The Venatori are in power, but Aelia wants total control. A blood ritual. Then the missing people... It's a lead. But where? When? Who else does Aelia break before I track her down? Nev? This place means something to me. But what am I to it if I can't... You'll catch Aelia again. Docktown's got someone looking out for them. They'll see that. I don't need to be the hero. I just need them safe. I'm a sucker, Rook. Getting caught up in all this. <laughs> Bad habit. You're not alone. That's how it is. How it's been. I know, but it doesn't have to be. Not with me. I mean it. I know. There are no further... We got rid of that haunting in Arlathan. 
It sleeps once again. Excellent work. This haunting, to our chagrin, was once one of our own Fade Explorers. He delved where he should not. How go your inquiries? Well, thank you. I've secured my attendance at the Sword of Drac... at the Royal Theatre tomorrow night. There's that haunting Myrna mentioned, the Fate Explorer. Just me, or was it extra cold around that thing we just fought? There are whispers. I took care of that Fate Explorer. We are greatly indebted. He can now rest for a time. Our collegial allies in the Fate have informed us of several undead banding together. They have begun to seek blood. Look, the statue that controls those bridges is broken. Doesn't matter. We can figure this out. There's a haunting. They're at range.
you've news? We finished off a whole group of skeletons. Interesting that they banded together. It availed them not. We've traced several disappearances to an unusual possession. It seeks fear. Cut it down. We've much to examine. The halls await. Storm Riders get really possessive about their hordes. She'll be tracking the scent of anything that got taken. Looks like they're talking about a dragon, Kataranda? Kataranda the Storm Rider. She's bad. She's real bad. Breathes lightning, like the Vinsimer. The Vinsimer was kind of friendly, though. Kataranda isn't. She is a bad dragon. Is there anywhere that Dreadwolf doesn't worm his way into? Nothing here. Maybe in the wreckage nearby. That ship might have hit a reef. In these parts, I bet someone sunk it.
can't believe we've got another archdemon to deal with. This time will go better. It has to. Do you think you'll survive this one? I don't know. Getting out of... Cataranda threw that ship like... Looks like something took the treasure and buried it. I can have a saw and start digging. Trouble ahead. Give me a minute. Right. Off at the treasure. Crows often develop expensive tastes. Maybe if I offer it a coin, it'll give up the treasure. It's only fair. The crows do not work for free. This is all of the treasure stolen from Kataranda. If we want to lure the dragon in, we should find someplace open. Maybe the beach where Tosh lured in the Vinsimer.
We just took down Deathstorm the Storm Rider. We are drinking for free tonight. There's some treasure caught in her scales. Yep. Storm Riders carry around bits of their hoard. I think maybe they get worried when it's not with them. 